Hey, what up, guys? Uh, I sort of found a way how to do this. Uh, actually, not really. We'll see how this goes. Let me know what you think if I even upload it. <laughs> um, Raptor credentials here, if you haven't already noticed. Uh, it might sound different because this is my iPad, but I'm going to be flying to Fort Zancudo. Get that F-16 and see how it flies around, you know? I've already tried twice, and uh, my flying skills for that thing hasn't been the greatest. The first time, really, not too long ago, like 20, 40, 30 minutes ago, something like that. Well, my game crashed because my iPod, iPad was uh, on top of my PS3. Too much, too much weight, huh? Yeah. Well, we'll see how this goes. I am Trevor right now. He's got no shirt on. Because he's a badass like that, you know? Unpredictable little guy. Little fucker. So how you guys doing? Good. I haven't seen you in a while. Sorry. Seen or talked to. Whatever. Should be making some more LCPDFR videos here soon. Uh, probably this weekend. I'm not sure yet. But yeah, let's see what we can get on doing this. It's just around this mountain. We'll see what uh, what it looks like. You know, the hint is when the music starts to play in the background a little bit, you know, it's telling you you're getting close to something that is either going to trigger something, like a, a, I don't know, like a cutscene, or someone's going to yell at you, you know? <laughs> but yeah, that's what the music hints at, that I've, that I've discovered, at least. Alright, so it's the uh, hangar way on the right, closest to me. On the right, yeah. We're gonna have to parachute into there, so it's gonna be cunning entry and escape. I've gotten really good at parachuting, so we'll see how this goes. Oh boy, I went into a bad of an angle. Oh boy. Oh my god, really? Sorry guys, I failed you. I've literally failed you. That's okay, he doesn't take any damage for that, so we're good here. That was a horrible entry, I apologize. I normally do better. The last two times I did perfect. Perfect jump in. But we're good so far, it looks like. Oh, now we're not good. If As soon as you see trucks here, and missiles are going to start shooting, we're going to get destroyed. Yeah, we're going to get shot at. Oh, boy. Gear up and out. Alright, we're out of there. Now we have to lose them, so. See how that goes. Oh, sorry, Mr. Aeroplane. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, that's going into the drink. Sorry, buddy. Uh, note to my viewers, if you slow down too fast in this aircraft, you will crash, no matter what. There's no ands, ifs, or buts about it because this plane decreases like a motherfucker. But uh, I'm going to try and lose these cops. Try and stay as close as you can to the bay. Now I think back there, or right here, this beach. No, not this beach. That beach back there that we just passed is a replica rendition of the uh, location as to which Two and a Half Men was indeed filmed at. So yeah, it's pretty neat information. I don't know if you care about that, but I was there actually walking that beach with a friend of mine from Cali. It's pretty cool. Let's employ some missiles.
Sweet. Uh-oh. That's not a good sound. Come on, guys. Let's, let's uh, leave me alone now, yeah? Oh, gosh. Missile lock. That's no bueno. You fly that way. I'll fly this way. Thank you very much. This plane has really good handling, if I'm honest. Now, if I'm honest again, I'm going to blow this blimp up. Okay, not. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> that was pretty sick. Thank you. Hey, you. Shut up. What was that? Did you see that? Hit the ground? I don't know what that was. Alright, choppers, leave me alone. We're good now. That is a beautiful city, if you agree, let me know. Yeah? I agree. Grew myself on that one. How long does it take to get away from the cops? Leave me alone, jeez. Holy crap, am I. Why would you come up this high? Leave me alone. Terminal velocity. Pull up. Pull up. Sorry, it's flight simulator stuff. That is a beautiful sun set. Yeah, there we go. Freaking finally. That's okay. You guys get a beautiful view of the city at nighttime. This is gorgeous. You guys want to know a quick tip? There is a um, park ranger police vehicle behind the volley, volley, behind the Vinewood sign, right in that parking lot, right below me, right there, right normally spawns. It's not there right now because like the first time you visit there, it's not there. But then you leave, walk away from it, and then come back, and it'll be there. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of GTA 5 so far. I think it's pretty amazing. I have to read. I have to go back and redo all the missions and just replay it because it's it's a really amazing story and you get a lot of a lot of stuff out of it. You know, just the first time through, you don't get as much. You just want to see how the mission plays out and how it you know portrays each individual character. And it's really awesome how they did the story. Props to Rockstar. Good job, guys. All right, yeah, guys. If you want to see anything specific, uh, don't be afraid and leave me a comment. I guess. And if this video is just shit, let me know, because <laughs> then I will f buy a capture card when I find some money, and I will uh, start uploading them that way. And we'll I'll redo the whole mission playthrough and stuff like that, and, and uh, we'll go from there. But yeah, this has been Raptor Credentials. Thank you guys for watching. Appreciate it. Stay vigilant. Raptor out.